And you know what's what's crazy too? What I know yeah, about you. Name. You see the name, like who wrote? When your shit took off on the TikTok, <laughs> all the songs start going crazy on TikTok. People thought that was like when you started. Yeah, a lot of people still think that to this day. Yeah, yeah. but it's funny because people don't never see an artist's backstory. Oh God! Just when the first time they hear him, that's when they look at. Yeah, yep. Oh, he that just came from nowhere. Yeah. Yep. But I'm like, damn! I remember when he dropped his shit and all that, and I was going back on eighty. Because I was cleaning up some songs on 80, uh, Apple Music one day. Oh, me. And it was a song with, this is like, probably what, three, four years ago? No, nah, it was like in 2017. Nigga. That's Damn. when I first, first started rapping. 2017, like, him and AD. That's crazy. And I'm like, oh, yeah. what the fuck? You got a song with AD? And he's yeah. like, yeah. <laughs> that was on my young, hungry shit. I ran into AD, like, at a uh, Rich the Cat, like, an album release. Okay. Some shit I was just at. Yeah. And I ran into him, and I always fuck with AD, so I, I got in his ear, like, look, nigga, I got... You feel me? X, 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 X amount of dollars on me right now. All right, <laughs> studio. Right he's, he's, he's a 75 He's a 75 nigga. Hey, you take a 75 right there. Oh, shit. Yeah, but that's how I locked that in. You feel me? He was right with it because we had the same engineer. Okay. So oh, there you go. Yep. There you go. Easy call. Knocked the verse right out. Well, that makes sense then. Yeah. Knocked it out. And then fast forward, nigga. 2017, fast forward. What was that 2022 when you say it took off? What was it take off? Yeah, the end of 2022. End of 2022. Took off. Boom. Well, what was your first initial? Like, how did you know? When, what was the moment when you knew? Like, your first one that took off, which which was, which one was the first was one? Whop it. Yeah. It was Whop It and then the, uh, the uh, Eat It Up. Eat It Up. So, Whop It took off first. Mm -hmm. Where was you, like, as an artist, what, like, when you knew, all right, it's about to go? Like, what was my reaction? Or, like, how like, did when I did know? you know? When did you know? When did I know? Shit. Probably on TikTok when I started seeing, like... Numbers go crazy? Yeah, like, I'm sitting there watching. They go from, like, 300 videos, you feel me, to, like, boom, 600 in, like, an hour or two. Yeah. And I'm like, what the fuck? That motherfucker was jumping up. I'm watching this shit. Like, the numbers just jumping up, you feel me? And I, it just took off from there. It never stopped. It just kept going up, going up, going up, and... Next thing you know, DMs started coming in and all types of shit. Damn. Yeah. I know that shit was up when I saw Asian bitches dancing to this shit. I was about to say. Oh, yeah. All racist. Hey, I was about to say. I swear I was about to say that. When I seen the white bitches and the Mexican bitches and the Asian, I said, oh, this nigga got one right here. Yeah. It's over. All the dancers. And they was fucking it up to it, too. I was like, oh. I got like a whole like Korean fan base people don't even know about. Yeah. You go on Twitter, type in like K-pop, they gonna be what? dancing my shit like crazy. Going crazy. That's man. tight. That K-pop shit big too. Hell yeah, big as fuck. I yeah. Know. Yeah, they take that shit and they, they be over there yeah. making all them dance routines yep. and yep. going stupid and oh, really yeah. be sparking them fires on TikTok. Yeah. They oh, be God. getting it cracking. Yeah. So TikTok, they talking about stripping that shit in January. Like, they been saying that for a minute though. They been saying they was gonna ban that shit. I tell you, the January nineteenth. Just never be official, like yeah. Oh, no. So, I mean, so once they do that, she. So what's the plan? What's <laughs> the plan of attack? <laughs> that's gonna hurt a lot that's of so niggas, man. Oh, my knees to cry. It's like so. What's the plan of attack, nigga? Like, because TikTok is really breaking a lot of that's careers. That's where it's at. Like yeah. it's not even Instagram no more. Like it's TikTok. Man, Instagram is bullshit now. It's like all on TikTok. You started seeing like all artists just migrating over to that shit. So yeah. what was the what was the bullshit about Instagram and, and why did it like Instagram migrate over to bullshit TikTok? Bullshit because they shadow banning everybody for the smallest shit. You feel me? Niggas uh, engagement be fucked up. Uh, Niggas have a hundred thousand followers get a hundred likes. Like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You feel me? Shit didn't used to be like that though. Like it just got crazy. It got crazy. Yeah, so niggas don't even really be fucking with it. Niggas still post, but it be like. You see, like, all artists care about TikTok now. Even, like, the older niggas, like, you feel me? Right. They, them niggas all trying to go viral on TikTok. Like, that's just oh, the way I be seeing a lot of the older niggas on TikTok now. Yeah, bro. Like, I'm like, they pay, uh, everybody catching on. So that's probably why Trump came out with that shit. You know what he said about uh, <laughs> letting people know why they shadow banned and, like, oh, yeah. and telling the other social media sites if people are getting their, you fucking their money up, they can sue you. Yeah. Like, nigga, like, he changing the game up. So maybe it's, like, in preparation for that, that yeah, get rid of TikTok to make Instagram easier to, mm -hmm. you feel me, promote your music, promote, you know, anything, shit, whatever you do, your business, any of all that shit. Right. Damn. Yeah, that nigga Trump ain't playing. Mm -mm. That niggas want their hands on that shit. Yeah, yeah. They want that to go through. 
They want their hands on that shit. They, he just want to get his hands in that pocket. Mm-hmm. It's so much money. <clears throat> so much money. I ain't going to lie. This, I'm like, damn, I ain't never saw like a... Like TikTok, when you look at the numbers it do compared to Instagram and everything else, you like, God damn. Oh, God. Yeah, TikTok millions, is really millions, a real factor. Quick, yeah. views real fast. Yeah. Do you actually be doing shit on there, though? On what? On your TikTok. What? Nigga, I am the reason niggas even fuck with TikTok. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> uh, <all right. laughs> nigga, I am the reason. Oh, my God in heaven. <laughs> Y'all niggas laughing, nigga. It's not even a joke. No, no I pressed the wrong button. This nigga hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong button. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I can see you didn't hear that no shit. Reason. This nigga hit the wrong button. Yeah, yeah, nah, nigga. That, that TikTok shit going stupid. It was stupid. like me, 310 baby, you feel me? Like, yeah. Kind of just started that wave of just like all that left, right, and ratchet shit and remixes, you feel me? Like, that shit just came from really me and then whoever else came after. I was just like the first one that really just got on there and just was dancing on it and bullshit, you feel yeah. me? Yeah. And how I did blew you, up on that motherfucker. I be I, creating dances and all that. How did you get so involved with like the dance community, with the, uh, the, like the clowns and... Shit, I just, just being like a young nigga from LA, I was always just like intrigued by that shit. You feel me? Like Tommy the Clown bouncing out at all the parties. Every party. Me? Like it just been around. I used to go to the battle zones and all that shit. But shit, once I blew up, that was just, I wanted to bring them with me type shit. Like, yeah. I want y'all right with me. Like, it was with a all good the energy. Move too. I had linked up with the Future Kings and shit. I don't know if y'all know them, but they popular yeah, yeah, dancers I'll... and artists and shit. Mm-hmm. You feel me? I had linked up with them. And once I linked up with them and put them together with like Tommy the Clown in my first video, it was just like I had to like, stamp uh... that image. Like, that's just was what it is. You feel me? Nigga went crazy from there. Hell yeah. yeah. No turning back. Yeah. So now, like, that's crazy. Yeah. So now with this project, like, what's the goal? Is this like... I mean, to be honest with you, this project right here was more so to just showcase my versatility. You feel me? Like, I know, like you just said earlier, like, a lot of people know a nigga from TikTok or my first few hits. You feel me? They don't even know the backstory. So this was just kind of like showing y'all I'm more than just the nigga that be in the club 24-7 with all the left-right shit and all the remixes, like... Right. This is to show like my real artistry and shit. The Niggas. versatility that you got. Yeah. You feel me? That's just what I was trying to showcase with this project and it's, it's going good for me for sure. Get a good response. Hell yeah, people fucking with it. Yep. All fourteen tracks. And you got your girl on the cover, lingerie. Yeah, lingerie that. Freaky nigga. <laughs> Tripping on shit. Tripping on shit. <laughs> got his girl on the cover. Tripping on shit. Out, nigga. Tripping on shit. <laughs> God, I'm not playing, nigga. Hey, shout out to you for watching that clip. Now be sure to smash the like and download Underdog Fantasy. All you have to do is pick higher or lower on players and you can win big. If you want to make some extra cash and have more fun while you watch sports, download Underdog and get up to a thousand times bonus cash. Just use my code, Ace Boys.